the next speaker for the day, uh, Mr. Pradeep Tripathi, who is the founder of Green Yatra. Now, Green Yatra is a leading environmental NGO in India, working on a green journey towards protection, conservation, and betterment of the environment since 2008. The organization works to create a habitat, greener earth, and a better world for the present and for the future generation. Their primary objective have always been to leave the world better than we found it. The NGO has to has created a pledge to plant almost 10 crore trees in India by 2025. Some of the initiatives which have been taken by this organization are paid lagao, back for cost, zarurat a need, uh, go green kids, green youth, green India, go green Ganesha, and many more. So let's hear from the uh, the tale from the man himself, Mr. Pradeep Tripathi, about the drive towards a green in India. Mr. Pradeep Tripathi, over to you. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, and uh, I'm really happy to uh, be the part of this, you know, very nice uh, live talk. And I'm really thankful to the uh, uh, Sanjay sir, Ajay Mathur sir, and uh, Tripathi, Arun Tripathi sir. And uh, it, was, you know, it, was, it was a pleasure to hear everyone, these you know, prestigious people, and definitely the uh, uh, Raman sir, because he is doing very wonderful job. So here I would like to share our work. So Green Yatra is working on the field of environment and we are uh, doing different kinds of work. So uh, we have a multiple projects. But here I'm focusing on 10 crore trees by 2025 and ecosystem re rejuvenation. It includes air, water, soil and how we are working. So we are working in the three layer. So <laughs> I would like to share this uh, with the <laughs> Uh, other initiatives, so these are our initiatives like a paint lagao, sustainable solution, green celebration, uh, uh, annual green tutorials, green campus. So these are the projects, gel, sustainable village, schools, farmers, and then the Jarurat. Uh, uh, so I would like to share more on the things so uh, people can check all these things uh, in our website. But first, you know, there is a certain question which are, are you know, uh, relevant to each and every city. Either the metro city is, uh, Raman sir said, that Delhi ke paas apna khud ka paani nahi. So, ye kisi bhi shahar ke paas nahi. Either it is the Mumbai, either it is the Delhi NCR, it is the Chennai, Pune, Chennai ka halat sab logo ne dekha hai. Even this year, Kochi was facing the water issue. So, uh, how we can fix all these things? Aur logo ko ab sochane ki jarurat hai ki aapki oxygen kaha se aati hai, aapka paani kaha se aata hai, aapka khana kaha se aata hai. So this is the question of not only in the, the government, it is the question of everyone. Everyone should think about it, how we can fix all these issues. So we have, you know, uh, this is not the only thing. So now you can see the lots of, you know, uh, the big picture is that pollution. We are uh, losing the billions of dollars each and every year. So people are thinking is staying in a big city is a, like a luxury, but it's for the studies. There is a, in all metro cities, if you are li living in the daily, your life is fun. Aapki jindagi ke lagbhag lag 10 se 11 saal tak kam ho sakte hain. Mumbai mein aapke saath se Har jage yehi kahani hai. So how we can fix it? So we are working in a project that is called 10 crore trees by 2025 and ecosystem rejuvenation. So is mein hum log pura ka pura ecosystem re revive kar rahe hain. So we are working in the three labor because we are mostly on the, uh, uh, we, we are known in the urban engine because the most Cities are creating the pollution, and then then 75 percent pollution is coming from the cities. Even in the world, top uh, you know 15 20 polluted cities in India ki 10 se 15 hote in even this year the most hottest cities in the world in top 10 we had many cities. So how we can fix all these issues? So we work in the three layers. So you can see the image. The, the green cover. This is the image uh, from the uh, Hyderabad Metropolitan Development Authority. So we are working in a process that where we have the center of the city from 100 to 150 km in the area. We create a green cover, we work on water conservation. Ka kaam kare. So cities can get their local food supply, oxygen supply, water supply, which we have to buy a lot of things from outside, which is not healthy for the environment. So coming on that, how we are working. So uh, action within the city is what we are taking. So we are using lots of innovation right so within the city 
we are creating different kinds of you know uh, uh, work we are doing hope you will be aware about the meyawaki plantations who is lots of green cities are coming green buildings is greha is implementing such kind of policies and assisting you know people and government body to become a green create a green building so how we can create the green ambience ambience kaise create kar sakte hain so you can see here we are using different kinds of innovative technologies suppose uh first we are doing a lot of rain water harvesting within the cities and definitely griha is also you know and the all such kind of organization are pushing to water conservation then coming on the how to create the uh, green environment so we are using lots of you know uh, you can see the uh, these urban forest we are creating jo pichle slide mein aapne dekha is just 8 month so 2 saal ke andar pura ka pura forest 2 feet ka pauda 20 se 25 feet ka ho jata hai and in one acre we can plant almost uh, 12 to uh, 12000 trees and all the native trees so they work like a ground water recharge unit and they also work like a carbon sink of the area so we are using these technologies within the city then we are also creating the fruit forest within the city school college jahan jahan pe bhi possible ho raha hai so we are promoting the water conservation uh, rain water harvesting so this is within the city coming on the second second line of work uh, area is work in the outskirts of the cities they are the mostly villages so we are creating sustainable villages where there we are creating lots of fruit forest then we are creating lots of organic farming jahan pe hum layer farming innovative farming natural farming so we are giving training to the farmers and the same time we are uh, reviving the water, old water bodies suppose koi talab hai lake hai ya a check dam and at the same time we are also creating a new water bodies so this is in the rural area so sara ka sara green cover shaharon ke bahar create kar rahe hain hum 100 se 150 km tak and when hamara pollution badhega so they can work like a cover so that is in the outskirts area then you can see the all these fruit forest are created by us now they are going up and giving the fruits parallel and green economy to the farmers then coming the final step reviving the degraded land jo pura area hai shaharon ke bahar jo bhi hame related to the mass so there we do the mass tree plantation and reviving the degraded land because india has a 30% degraded land jo dead land hum ise bolte hain ise banjar zameen bolte hain so it is like uh, if you area mein hum accumulate kare ki kitna hoga to maharashtra madhya pradesh and rajasthan ka jo combined area hai utna bada area almost 30% is the dead land और यदि हम इसे रिवाइव कर दें वी कैन सेट अप द इंडस्ट्रीज देयर वी कैन क्रिएट द फूड फॉरेस्ट वी कैन इन्वॉल्व द लोकल कम्युनिटीज सो इट कैन कंट्रीब्यूट अप टू 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 3% इन आवर जीडीपी एंड आई एम हैप्पी टू एटलीस्ट दिस गवर्नमेंट इज फोकसिंग ऑन दैट बिकॉज़ दे हैव सेट अप अ टारगेट कि बाय 2030 हम 10 मिलियन हेक्टेयर का एक करेंगे एंड वी आर वर्किंग इन दिस एरिया लाइक यू नो यू कैन सी इन द इमेजेस वी क्रिएट द लॉट्स ऑफ डेड बॉडीज जो डेड लैंड है उनको हम ग्रीन लैंडस्केप में क्रिएट कर रहे हैं द फूड फॉरेस्ट देन लार्ज स्केल वाटर कंजर्वेशन रिचार्ज ग्राउंड वाटर रिचार्जेबल जो हम करने के लिए कर रहे हैं सो वी क्रिएट दिस काइंड ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर एंड द बेस्ट एग्जांपल आई विल लाइक टू शेयर बाय द मजसा दैट वाज द महार मुख्यमंत्री जल संवर्धन योजना दैट वॉज द वन ऑफ द लार्जेस्ट क्लाइमेट चेंज प्रोजेक्ट बाय द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ राजस्थान सो आई थिंक दीज आर द एरिया इफ यू डू द ऑल थिंग्स विथ अ प्रॉपर प्लानिंग एज वी आर डूइंग most of the city in and around the cities so we can resolve the problem and what will be the impact of all these things fresh water cleaner air healthier food uh, you know uh, also improve financial status of the farmers women agriculture stakeholder and indian gd and healthy because you know health is very important and oxygen is polluted which is it is you know most of the population of the world can't afford a single day oxygen because iski jo keemat hai wo 13 lakh ke aas paas hai when aapki delhi mein aapne dekha hoga ek oxy bar khula hai to get the pure oxygen in just you know half 15 minute it is costing us almost 500 rupees so we are looking ki ye cheeze jo basic you know oxygen abhi hum wo time nahi dekhna chahte hain ki jab oxygen cylinder aane lage and people are selling ki oh this is oxygen directly from the himalaya aur aam public to public म्यूनिसिपल्स के ऑक्सीजन जो अच्छी क्वालिटी की नहीं होगी यूज करना पड़े सो इफ यू वर्क ऑल टूगेदर सो दिस इज ऑल प्रोजेक्ट यू नो वन ऑफ द मेजर प्रोजेक्ट वी आर डूइंग एंड वी हैव अदर प्रोजेक्ट टू सपोर्टिंग द एनवायरमेंट सो दिस इज ऑल फ्रॉम माई एंड वॉट वर्क वी आर डूइंग 
so people can be the part of the green yatra and for the school college housing society government bodies our all project are absolutely free we don't charge anything we are working with the railway indian uh, defense forces state reserve police forces railway uh, state government of delhi maharashtra madhya pradesh and many more cities so we will be happy in the but we are mostly focus, focusing on the top 30 most polluted city as of now thank you very much uh, thank you pradeep ji uh, for your you know so kind information that you have shared and the initiatives that you have taken towards you know making the in the environment healthier and greener you now as per a, i remember as per a world health organization report a person needs almost 9 square meter of dense green belt area to you know mm. to get its oxygen supply so you know mm. if we multiply the the population the massive population we have almost yeah. you know 90% of the country has to be you know grown up with trees uh, well yeah. in a scenario that we are living on you know the 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 the, the the oxygen supply that we have is you know not not that adequate mm-hmm. and that is you know has led to a lot of problems health problems specifically if i talk about now mm-hmm. that we are facing so well i you know thank you so much for your time and you know sharing the information that you have i okay. also you know, request all our attendees to you know to join the initiatives that have been taken by both the organizations whether you know it's been the the need foundation where they are working on water a primary resource and green yatra where they are working on you know ensuring that the environment that where where we are living you know has to be greener